a little while ago um, we may have all got an update to Google Docs mobile on Android and in this one it promised insert header and footers which is a bit tricky and that's why I'm showing you and also image editing which can be not so tricky but I will show you as well so we start off and remember a couple of days ago I did this thing called the buzzard which was on a Google Doc now what we've already done dealing with the images first is I've inserted a big image here and I'm going to edit it. You'll notice it looks a bit awkward at the moment so click on it once and we can hit the A on the top right and that will bring up some formatting so what we can do is if I want to text wrap that I would like to put that as a wrap text and you will see that just looking over the back there you can see all the text has jumped up to the right hand side then if I also want to look at some of the options I can click the image I can click the three dots and I've got image options and then I can put a border around the outside let's say if we wanted one which was going to be grey and you can see it comes along uh, line colour back and then we've got line weight I can make it aggressively bigger or a little bit um, smaller like that. I can change the dots around the outside, that looks horrendous. We could go with um, dotted, dashed or a solid line and then looking at the bottom we can reset the image if we wish to which I've just done. Now um, if I go on that one more time we can see that I can replace the image and also on the image options we can look at text wrap, line colour as I said, line weight, line dash and reset. That will do for the images I think. I think you can find your way around that. Now the only thing I would say on this and that is that you'll notice that it's very handy when it's on print layout. When you go back off of print layout you'll see, oh where's the image gone? Um, let's go back a bit. What have I done? What have I done? Interesting that I'm, I'm going back there and I can't, okay that's fine let's just do something where we're going to say I want to plus insert an image and I want to do one from the web this is an extra bit of fiddly bits here and I want to do a buzzard and let's pick a different buzzard this time shall we and let's get one in flight like that that will do insert it okay that's fine so that's how to insert it and format it now let's go back and this time I want to look at the header and the footers. Now this is a definite one where we have to go on to the three buttons on the top right and switch to print layout. Now watch this, oh the images has come back again, doesn't matter. Look on the very very top and you'll see that there is a blank area. What we have to do once you're in, and I'll just check, check print layout, what you do is you click into the top area. You'll notice there's a tiny little line and I'm going to write header area text in it and it'd be better if I could actually spell header so we've got header text area if I hit OK on that or the tick rather you can see that if I come off of print layout there's nothing in the document there's nothing there if I go back to print layout and I click in the top area or just tap in the top area you can see that there is an area there. Forgive the image at the bottom. Let me show you this, um, which is a bit better. So I'm at the bottom of the document. I tap just once, and you can see that it's um, made an area there, and I want to edit it. And then when I go down to the very bottom, I tap, and you can see the little line there, and it offers me already, and I'm going to put page number just to get this point and I'm going to hit the little button there that gives it number one okay and then if you like I'm going to get this select the text and put it in the center and then click off of it again you can see that it says page number one so if I go back to the top again and I click print layout off you'll notice looking at the very top of the document there is nothing there and there is nothing there at the bottom either but remember you must be in print layout to see these things. This page number at the bottom, look, you can see if I squirt that down you can see that it says page number one at the bottom and at the very top it says header 
area. If you want to get help on this and this is to finish this video, we go to help and feedback and the help I would actually look for would be if I type in the search box head uh, and it says on Android we can go down and this is number five that I'm paying attention to open the document that's fine tap edit in the top right tap more turn on print layout that's fine number five tap the header or footer that's the area that caught me out a little bit earlier you have to tap it you just have to kind of like know that it's there uh, which you might do if you've been working on a desktop machine type in the text you want da, 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 da. oh change margin size now I did not see that earlier so there's something extra I have just learned. Printer document spreadsheet. Um, I'm not sure that that is a mobile thing. Doesn't matter. Let's end the video there. Um, it's another tip which we've just ended.